I guess you are still and today in view the Lipin like Wallet Speed Champions Mercedes Benz AMG GT3. So this is the box here. So yeah, you can see it's recommended for just 7 to 14 and it's set to a 3 and comes with 200 and uh, 12 pieces and you got the Lipin logo right there and also gain the champions for some reason. And the top here does have a, a handle and the bottom and the side and the other side and the, the back here so shows you the picture of uh, the real car and also uh, the features so uh, this is the instruction manual here and yeah it's just the front of the box and the back of the box and yeah um well I just turned turn this thing so yeah that's kind of bad but yeah this is just the first page and you know it has a tape there so that's why it's uh, sticking and everything but yeah this is the last page here and yeah this is the back just the back of the box here nothing so special so yeah that's it for the instruction manual so this is the driver itself here so you can see uh, he has a wrench uh, to you know change the rims and yeah so you got the Mercedes logo here which is pretty cool and you know he has just the uh, black racer helmet and you can open it up the visor and uh, if you pull this uh, you can see his face here and he does not have any alternate facial expression but yeah I just got a uh, yellow stripe going through there so yeah that's cool and uh, the logo here itself here looks great and the back here got the AMG logo and also this yellow stripe and you know just a little bit of a uh, uh, gray gray printing over there. So this is the um, Mercedes-Benz AMG GT3. So yeah, it does kind of look like the real uh, road car, but yeah. Um, so the front here, uh, you got this really nice grill with the Mercedes-Benz uh, logo and also the uh, headlights with uh, stickers on them. And the sticker on this set do suck, so that's um that's a thing. So, yeah, but uh, this thing, uh, the front bumper and the grill and everything, you can remove it because it's on a Technic axle. And you know, there's the interior of this thing inside the structure bill of this thing. And yeah, it does have an alternate one, which the sticker is uh, printed wrong. So yeah, that's kind of a bit of a problem. And you know, the stickers, they aren't cut, uh, the cutting of the stickers aren't so great. But you can just put this in to make uh to make it look like uh, more of a um like the road car I guess but yeah so uh you can see you got uh, some more stickers yellow stripes and all these black stuff but yeah you got the, this vent thing going here and the the windscreen you got the AMG sticker and the doors uh, it does have the doors you got the door handle there but obviously it, it cannot open but you know the, you got the 16 here you got the exhaust I guess it's probably the exhaust but yeah you also got the sticker right there and you know the yellow wheels do look pretty cool and uh, the top here got another yellow striping and yeah and here I uh, got this um this sticker black sticker piece and also this uh, crunch uh, crunch black piece uh, cheese slope piece and the spoiler at the back is um, you know pretty cool it's on the groin arms you can move it around and it does have a big AMG logo on it and yeah that's just that and you know if you want to make it look like the road car you can remove it along with this uh uh one by one by two uh cheese load piece and you can just remove it and yeah that's really it i guess but you know um here you got uh the lights here the the tail lights and yeah they do look do look pretty cool with the uh, one by two towel piece like uh angle to the side and yeah uh, you also got this amg kind of license plate thing and you also got all these vents or 
exhaust there, but they are probably just vents. And the interior, uh, you just have a steering wheel, and you can put the race car driver in. You can close it up, and yeah, you just be inside. And uh, you know, this is just how the car looks. And you know, uh, they they also have uh, different uh, styles of uh, rims. So yeah, let's show you that. So these are the alternate rims. I did I did not uh, tear it apart because you know it looks nice in this non tear out front form. So yeah, but you know uh you, you know you guys know how these things look. So you know it it probably won't be a problem. But yeah, so uh you know that's really it for the car. So conclusion of this set. Well, I think this set here is um it's okay uh, but the stickers quality they do kind of suck the cut of the stickers aren't so great and you know like the uh, you obviously have this problem the sizing problem and also like yeah when I tear the sticker apart uh, it it uh, you know it uh, split into two so yeah that's kind of a problem there but you know aside from that um maybe if you uh get the this set uh, maybe you won't uh, encounter these uh sticker problems because it's just depending on the batch i guess but you know like overall it's a great set um if you can't afford the uh, the official Lego set. I recommend you getting it, uh, or you know, to call uh, to collect all the Speed Champion set. I guess, but uh, you know, I, overall I think that it's a uh, pretty cool that uh, Leapin made this set so that um, the ones who like these cars can get it. So. Yeah, that's uh, really it for this set. So yeah, if you want to buy a set, I'll put a buy link down in the description box below along with all of my social media pages down in the description. So if you want to join physical alternative bricks, I'll put a link down in the description box below as well. But thanks for watching, I'll be seeing you very soon.